Hi folks, John Richardson once again here at the best dealership in the country, Guarantee RV, Junction City, Oregon. You know, all the time, we're always looking for a great product. We just took a line on, we just got them, and you can be the first to get one. They're called the Keystone Outback. In the Keystone line, as you probably know or don't know, there's many, many products and different lineups. What we have chosen is the best built Keystone product that we can put our hands on, and that is called the Outback. And what's so great about this is it is a very, very lightweight travel trailer. Aluminum frame, fiberglass sidewalls. Today I'm going to show you what's called a 2000 or a. Uh, uh, I forgot the name of it, uh, OUR 23 foot. Now what that means is it's a, a rear slide. So the benefit of this guy, for people that need to sleep a lot of people, this is a bunkhouse model, it will compact down into 23 foot and extend out to 29 foot when you get to where you're going. So for those of us that have small driveways, and don't want to pay storage, this guy fits the bill. I'm going to show you a little about it. Starting off, we're going to start off with an electric hitch. We're going to start off with two propane tanks that we're going to fill, and we're going to give you not one, but two brand spanking new batteries. Now, being here for almost 27 years, I've had the pleasure to talk very, uh, a lot about the different products. This is a very, very lightweight product. We've got a good supply coming in, so if you're in the market to have a dealership that's been in business 50 years, this is the place to, deal, to do the business with. We do complete walkthroughs on them. We're going to assure you everything's in perfect shape, and we're going to show you how to keep it in perfect shape, up to and including a free roof inspection once a year. You can bring it in. We'll get up there and do all the looking and see if we got a problem somewhere and tell you about it. So I want to go around. I'm going to start off with, we got a little bit of storage on one side. On the other side, there's very little here that, you know, you can put a handful of small tools here. Let's walk around over here. This being a bunkhouse model, we have the outside door and look at this. I've taken the liberty to bring me bunk up or we can bring it down so if you want the kids want to take bicycles that type of thing you put the you put the bed up when you get to where you're going you put the bed down we've got two bunks here i'm going to show you so this guy will sleep six eight people pretty easy in a 23 foot trailer so when you're not needing a bed you put it up here fasten it down we've got stuff here but you also can Put all your bicycles, that type of thing. You know how kids are. They've got lots of stuff that they want to take with them. This gives you the ability to do it. Now, this guy here, like I told you, has a rear slide out. Before we get in there, I'll let you figure out what this is. We have a sink and we have a two burner stove and an electric awning, and you'll notice we've got two marine grade speakers on the outside. The reason for that, most of us aren't gonna be inside on a beautiful day like today. We're gonna have the awning out. The family's out here playing. You can stay inside when you get home or when it's time to go to bed at night. So typically you're gonna be doing all your cooking out here for the most part out where the family is. Let's go inside. Notice we got a freestanding grab or a, a free folding handle freestanding. So here's the inside. We got the bunk beds here. I'll drop it down, show you again. Bunk beds here. Nice cabinet with storage inside so that you can put hanging clothes, that type of thing, and an electrical outlet up above it. And then I want you to take a good look throughout the coach here. This is what we call our rear king-size bed. 
Now earlier today, believe it or not, I tried it out both ways. You can sleep, sleep in it lengthwise or crosswise. So in the event you don't want to climb over each other, then obviously you're going to sleep in it north to south. Plenty of room. I'm almost six foot tall. Didn't have any problem. I can slip out, go to the bathroom, what have you. You'll notice here that we have a booth to sit around in the evening, play games. We got a couch that makes up into a bed. Now you may be wondering, well, how does that bed come up with the couch? Well, what you do is when you're setting the bed up or bringing it in, you just drop your couch down. You drop this cushion down, drop your table down. The bed electrically comes in to be 23 feet long. Now here you'll notice we've got the proverbial refrigerator that happens to be an eight cubic foot refrigerator. These guys, in case I didn't mention it, come with a one year bumper to bumper warranty. Very, very nice size refrigerator. Again, more cabinets, permanent shelves here. You've got a drawer down below. You have a massive single double sink, if that makes sense galley faucet, more cabinets up above. Very, very well put together. All your cabinets are all screwed together, glued and screwed, so they're gonna hold up for you. Of course, we've got stereo. We've got a TV that'll move around to whatever direction you need it to be so the kids can watch movies, that type of thing. We've got electric gas and electric gas and electric hot water heater monitor panel you got a power slide out room we've got an awning and then of course the furnace three burner stove again stainless package has a 17 inch oven in it just a very very nice unit just in time for summer We've got lots and lots of units coming in this month. In fact, I heard we have more coming in than we actually have on the ground, and we got about 400. So, the other thing I want to tell you about, most important, these have holding tanks in them. You have a bathtub, you've got a toilet, and how about a sink and a medicine cabinet where it should be, and that is in the bathroom. So a person can take a shower, comb their hair, put their face on before they come out in public. So we all work here on commission. I would really appreciate it if you got any questions. Feel free to give OJR a call. If I don't know the answer, I'll bet you I can find somebody that does. I really, really appreciate your time watching this video. Come on out and check out our inventory. This is the best place in the country to do business. I'd really look forward to meeting you. Thank you for your time.